Hi traders, just want to give you a further update for the euro dollar this week. Now we do have the US CPI data coming out this evening, 10.30 p.m. And ahead of that event, we are very range bound. High time frame weekly trend is up. This is corrective. Are we bottoming out here for a further move up in line with the weekly trend? Now, of course, we could break south. We don't know what the CPI data will bring tonight. So at the moment, we are holding on day support, 109.43, as said on Tuesday, watch that level for support. And we're being held at weekly resistance at 110.12. So these are the two levels to watch when the news event comes out tonight. At the moment, we're stuck in the middle of those two levels. My overall bias is to the upside until proven different because the higher time frame trend is up, but we'll have to wait and see what the CPI data brings. So with that in mind, let's just drop down to the fire chart and have a closer look. All right, Tres, onto the far chart. As I've been saying this week, I'm more inclined to go with the weekly trend, which is up. At the moment, we're just stuck in the middle of day support and being held at weekly resistance. So when the CPI data comes out after that event, I'm watching this level down here. Day support 109.43 down to 109.27. Does price come down into this area? Hold. Can you see a setup to buy? to trade back up the range. All right, that's scenario one. Of course, when the data comes out, we could spike up to 110.12 and hold and not want to move above. So if that level holds and doesn't want to move above, then you could of course then look at the top of the range here for a trade down. All right, so we could actually just stay within this range after the CPI data. I'm looking for a spike down, ideally, this area to hold for a move up to break above 110.12. But we could just stay within the range. We could move up to 110.12, hold, and then want to cycle back down the range. So at the moment, we are range bound. Will the CPI data break price out of the range, or will we just remain in the range? So if we remain in the range, you have to trade it like it is a range and look to trade up from support and trade down from resistance. And finally, traders, I'll give you an update this evening in the live Fox trading webinar. If you'd like to join me, simply register at the link below.